channel this is Aina again so today we are going to make a chicken wings caldereta yeah we're going to make some chicken caldereta guys and I hope that you like my recipe today and this is really good and perfect for white rice or brown rice or anything that has a little carbs you know like a carbs right there so we are going to start now guys okay so i have a pan heating up up here so we're going to fry our chicken first so we're gonna put some oil that would be great okay and we will wait to heat it up and this is my chicken this is a chicken wings so what i did in my chicken wings guys is i use a um, a little salt pepper uh basil and i just breaded them with instead of regular flour i like using my rice flour so that's what i view uh i use for this uh chicken right here because it gives so much crunch on your chicken so what we're going to do is just fry them okay guys okay guys so we're going to fry our chicken now Ooh, so excited oh yeah hear that guys that's sizzling right there uh-huh yum i'm so excited on this delicious All right, so what we're going to do is just fry them for like um, two to three minutes each side and then we'll flip it over guys. All right, all right. So excited with my chicken calderella. Yes. So we're going to go back on our chicken frying. Guys, after three minutes, we're going to flip it over, okay? Oh, look at that! Look at that baby wings right there! Yum! Oh, can you hear the sizzling, guys? You can even hear my voice. Me talking because of this crunchiness of this chicken. Yeah. Ooh, it's so good. Look at that. Guy. So we're going to fry for another three minutes, guys. Okay. There you go, guys. So our chicken is already fried right here. Look how nice and crunchy that is, guys. So we're going to make our sauce now. Okay. So I have. I'm gonna be using the pan that I used to fry my chicken because that's where the flavor is so i'm gonna add my onion oh that's so good look at my eyes it's watering all right and then our garlic garlic so i'm gonna be using my fried garlic up here because this adds so much flavors guys so all i need is just a pinch of garlic not that much or two depends on your uh taste okay mix them up so this is the oil that i used to fry i may add a little bit more for my frying for my sauté it's hot hot guys so just a little bit more there you go oh that's so good and then i'm gonna add my carrots right there and right here i'm gonna add my carrots to caramelize our carrots comes out the natural flavor of sweetness of carrot and then our potatoes right there potatoes Ooh, delicious. Smells so good 
So what we're going to do is just uh, fry them for like a minute or two. And we will... Uh, and you know what guys, while we are frying or browning our vegetables, I'm going to put a little bit of pepper to taste. All right. And then we will cover them. Okay, guys? Okay, guys. After a couple of minutes, you can see the carrot and potato is starting to turn brown. And oh, it smells so good. Caramelizes the onion and garlic. And then we'll add some celery. Yum. Celery in the moonlight. Okay. It's a little smoky, guys. Miss pardon me. And I'm just gonna add a little bit of soy sauce, okay? Just a little bit. Soy sauce right there. Ooh, look at that smoke. Yum. Delicious. Then we will add our tomato sauce. Okay. I'm gonna be using ragu. Ragu raya. Ragu. Oh yeah. Look at that. Delicious. Guys, look at me. Ooh, it's a little smoky. Smoky like me. Smoking hot. <laughs> Alright, mix it up. And then I'm gonna add a little bit of water. Can I have a little bit of water, Baba, please? Thank you. Okay. Gonna add a little bit of water so we can simmer them and cook the carrots and potatoes. Oh, it smells so good, guys. And then we will add our uh, pepper and olive, black olive, on the last minute. Okay, guys? So we will simmer them for like two or three minutes. Just enough to cook down our uh, sauce and at the same time to caramelize the tomato sauce and to tenderize our potatoes and carrots. Guys, after three minutes of our simmering down our sauce, we're going to add the last one is our pepper. I have a green pepper up here. Okay. And then I have the red pepper. And you know what I have right here is a roasted one right there. To have, ooh, it smells so good. I like this roasted one, uh, guys, because it's smoky flavor so we're going to add oh delicious i'm excited with this chicken caldereta yum okay so that's what we have and of course our black olives right there i'm gonna open them black olives Oh, this is one of uh, my husband's favorite sides. Okay, so I'm gonna add black olives right there. It's already sliced, so this is very convenient. Delicious! All right, that should be good. Then we'll mix it up. See how nice that is, guys. <laughs> Delicious. I love this. Mm. Oh my goodness gracious. This smells so good. Yum. Okay. And then to have an extra, extra, extra is we're gonna put an extra cheddar cheese. Extra, extra. So we want to add a little bit of 
saltiness to it. <laughs> yes, ma'am. <laughs> oh, it smells so good. And then, mix it up. Delicious. This is so good. And you know, guys, I'm going to add a, just a little bit of uh, tomato sauce, okay? And then the last thing is I'm going to add our chicken. Just a little bit. Should be good. Oh. Yum, yum, yum. Okay. Then a little bit more pepper to taste. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Mix it up. This is delicious, guys. Oh, I can smell the cheesy flavor right there. Okay, and then I'm going to add our chicken now. Okay. Right there. Mm -mm -mm. Guys, chicken wings. Right there. Oh. Yum. Where is it? There you go. And we will add our chicken wings. Oh, this is so good. Delicious. Yum. Oh, yeah. And who doesn't like this? Who doesn't like this chicken cheesy caldereta? We will blanket this chicken wings with the sauce. Yes, ma'am. Uh -huh. Look at that thing. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. All right. Oh, it smells so good. That should be ready for plating. Guys, well, thank you so much, guys, for watching, and I hope that you like my video today. Yes, ma'am. And don't forget, guys, to like, share, and subscribe, please. And don't forget to click the notification bell so you will be updated every time I upload a new recipe, new ingredients. And I'm so excited. And thank you so much, guys, for always supporting my channel. This is once again Anna. Thank you so much. Bye. Chicken called the red up.